Welcome to the introduction to our EDU Onyx series projects in Django. In this course, we're going to look at building a variety of web applications using Python and the Django web framework to look at a few of the more advanced concepts within using Django. So within this course, we're going to look at building five different individual Django applications that will each use specific features of the Django web framework that we're going to look at in detail when building these. We'll work on building a blog, a survey site, a message board, an image sharing web application, and an e-commerce web store, all using Python and the Django web framework. Through looking at each of these, we'll take a look at some individual features of Django, and we can see just what a few of those will be. Through looking at all of the five projects that we have planned for this course, we're going to look at image fields, a way that we can upload images and store them as part of our Django application. We'll look at more complex object relationships, like how we can have objects related to other objects, many-to-many -many fields, one-to-many fields, and how to set these up in Django and access the individual objects we'll be creating. We'll look at the user objects and how to create users, uh, within the aspect of how to sign up users for a particular site and allow those users to log in and then only allowing those users to access the appropriate data. And we'll also look at the Django session, a way for us to store values that persist from a user's particular login session and then are deleted when that user logs out or exits the page. So these are just a few of the concepts that we'll look at within this course. Before starting this course, you're going to need to have at least an intermediate level understanding of the concepts of Python. In order to become more familiar with Python as a programming language, in order to start programming with Django, there's another course by EDU Onyx called Learn Python Programming from Scratch. It'll teach you everything you need to know to prepare for this course. That course will also teach you the basic knowledge of Django, what it is as a web framework, and the basics of the Django file structure that we'll be working with within all of the projects that we'll look at in this course. Once you understand those two concepts, you'll be able to move forward and get started with this course, Projects in Django.